Kathy, I'm going to step behind you, but I don't want to accidentally bump you. Not yet. Is he sleeping? No, not yet. He was earlier. But he's going to run comfortably. He, he's just wonderful. This is our butter butter boy. Okay, we have. Hi, buddy. <laughs> Oh my golly. There is never ever another cat that's been like putter and there never will be another putter. <laughs> I just love him. Hi. I don't know. He got something. Say hi. We have four boxes and then we do have some envelopes that I just brought in. I haven't really even got to look at them yet. And this one came from an Amazon. Oh yes. And we have a paper. Here, now wait, now those here, hon, why don't you give them me what, I got a new system, babe. I'm trying to be neater, so when I'm done with the box, I put the things back in. So it doesn't take me quite so long to clean up. This says, I recently found your rescue and have been watching the webcam every day for about a week. You are all doing a wonderful thing for the cats and I just wanted to help. Thank you for your devotion. Um, and this is from Virginia K. From Virginia K. Thank you, Virginia. And we have two cases of Fancy Feast. And it's grill, one is grilled and one is classic. And they are both seafood. So, of course, the kitties will like this. Thank you, Virginia. That's very kind of you. And we're very glad that you found our webcam. We like to we like to have people watch the kitties. Thank you, Virginia. I don't know where Virginia's from. Maybe Virginia's on and can tell us. My sister Judy was here today and yesterday, and she worked on the food cabinets, and it's just so nice. She just organizes everything. It it makes it easy for me. This one is also from an Amazon from Pennsylvania. I always like to see where the Amazons are from. This one was from Indiana. It's okay, Raza. Oh, yay. This is another. Oh, but I don't have a tag on it. This is a case. Oh, this is one of those uh, Fancy Feast Delights with cheddar, with cheddar cheese on it, or cheddar cheese in it. It's a, um, the cats like it. There's real hunks of cheese in those. I don't have who brought that, though. Does anybody know? Okay, well, if you're on and you donated that, it's a Fancy Feast Delights with um, cheddar. And the cats, as you know, like it. We've been, like for breakfasts in the morning, I've been using um, two cans of Fancy Feast equals one can of Friskies. So I've been giving them that, and they, they're really, really liking their breakfasts. <laughs> this one is, we'll, we'll finish up the Amazon boxes. This one's another Amazon boxes from Indiana. Are you comfortable there, Potter? Yeah, oh. Uh, yeah. This is from Auntie Bantry. Only the soft... Oh, <laughs> you'll like this unique. Only the softest hands should cuddle my putter butter. Mm -hmm. Auntie Bantry. Thank you, Bantry. Oh. She and Bantry's has kept us in supply of our uh, lotion, which we use a lot of. Our hands are always, always, oh, I got three cracks on my finger, fingers right now. They do not feel good. Thank you, Bantry. This is really nice. Um, I know where one of these is going. Is back in uh, Thumper's room. Thanks, Bantry. This is the best uh, lotion. It's the Gold Bond Ultimate Healing with Olay. This this is really good stuff. It helps a lot. We wash our hands so much here. And 
<clears throat> they really take a beating, especially in, in this winter time. <laughs> so thanks, Bantry. Hey, what are you doing? Huh? Now put one of those right away back there in Bumper's room. Okay. Okay, Tilo. Mm -hmm. Why don't you go sit up there with your mama? Come on. Come on. We always can tell here, we always say, we can tell when winter's coming because all of our hands start cracking here. And this one is from, not from Amazon, it says, oh, that nature's horse that we had, oh, the other day. Oh, there's, <laughs> you guys are getting us ready for baby season. <laughs> um, <laughs> right around the corner. The, it is. The, see, the kitty season is near. Here's a little something that I hope you can use. Thank you, Jackie, and the volunteers for all you do for the cats. Much love. Gitty, I think is how you pronounce it. G-I-T-T-E. Gitty uh, T from Denmark. From Denmark. And it's the big one. Uh, five pounds? Is that five pounds? Yeah, five pounds of the KMR powder. You know, usually wow. we don't really start seeing kitties in heat too much until March. Here, Jossie, I'll take it and put it with those. Thanks, babe. Um, but I cannot tell you how many people have been saying their cats are in heat already. And this winter's just been crazy. It's just, it's been so warm. We've had very little snow. And this week, again, it's supposed to be, did you hear that, Kathy? 50? Yeah, I guess. It's crazy. Crazy, I just crazy. One snow day. I know. Well, I like, I wouldn't mind one big snow and then melt real fast. But. And we have a one pack. Oh, this is for my mom for her birthday. Oh, I got to tell you a really cool thing. My sister Patty, the, my youngest one that had stayed here and came home for um, when my dad was bad. Um, then she went back to Idaho. She it has a job interview a week, or she's flying in here. It's in Indiana for a job interview, and it's at <coughs> the Parkview Hospital. And oh, I hope and pray that she gets it. And if so, that means that she will be getting a house there or something to live in in Indiana. She'll be just an hour away. And uh, she flies in a week from today. That's my mom's birthday. We're going to take her out to eat supper that night. And Patty will be with us. So oh, that's pretty cool. And then she has to go back then on Sunday. But hopefully we'll be coming back again real soon. Uh, so this one is from my mom from PMH. And this one is... Uh, I, mean, I don't know the first name, but it's from the Netherlands from my mom. Oh, this is from Joanne. Joanne H. from Arizona. That's for mom. Carol. Oh, this is CJ Cat. Is for my mom. She's going to flip out when she sees all these all these uh, cards. Oh, Joanne, I like your stamp. It's one of those animal rescue with the Siamese looking kitty. Uh-huh. Here. Kind of, kind of, sort of, maybe looks a little bit like Emily or like uh, Asha. And this one is for the rescue center. Oh, and this is from Kaya. Kaya R. And she's from from Canada, from on Ottawa, Ontario. And it's Kaya K Y A R. I think my blade must be starting to get a little dull. I hear you, Jazzers. Just give me a few. Probably. Oh. oh, my goodness. We're going to put these up, too. I don't send Valentine's to just anybody. Oh, look at that. So it starts out like this. Oh, look at that. Isn't that cool? Only those who have a special place in my heart. 
just a little note to say thank you for the hours of enjoyment I get out of your out of your rescue. Oh, the light is shining right on it. Something to see in the awesome Valentines taking the volunteers taking such wonderful care of the kitties. It's indeed. It, I've included some Valentines for the kitties. Two are very special though. One is for uh, my favorite kitty, Orange Tabby. Can you guess who? Plymouth. And one is a secret crush for Cutie. You'll enjoy, or those on the, oh I'm sorry, I'm having a hard time reading this one. You'll find those on the front of the card. As always, for the FFR City Kitties, Happy Valentine's Day. And this is Sporeo, S-P-O-R-E-O. And and you know what? Even though it's past Valentine's Day, we don't care. We'll we'll tape every one of these up there. Yeah, these are from Sporeo. This one is for all the kitties, and they're all Hello Kitties. Uh, oh, and this is for my kitties in the house. Haven't met you, but know you. You're well loved. <laughs> the lovely mods. Oh, thanks for all you do. This is for you moderators. And who's on? Bantry, Canton, Dawnstar, Gemini, Tommy, Napa, and Titan, and Yvette. Wow, we got a bunch of them on tonight. All the lovely FFRC volunteers. Vera, such a pretty girl from Sporeo. From Cutie, keep amazing us with your spirit. Aw, that is very nice. From Badu, behave yourself. <laughs> She was rocking and rolling this morning. For Tweenie, uh, for Tweenie, you're um, something you're jumping. For Tweenie girl, for Twinkle, you're a doll. Oh, isn't this cute? For Jaken, take care of that tail. <laughs> Promise you're a special little kitty. Yes, she is indeed. These are cute. For Sheriff Putter, you're a ham, fuzzy boy. <laughs> Queen Bella, you're the master of scoots. <laughs> That's cute too. I like that. Patty Purr and Kate. Kate, keep running and making us laugh. You know, they're experts at that wheel. Tilo, may you always have rings to chase. Dugster, behave yourself, big boy. And Holly, such a gentle spirit. Aw, Sporeo, this is so sweet. I will take tape and I'll put every single one of them up there on the door for you. <laughs> is it? And, and uh, or, uh, Jocelyn says, you're the perfect catch Valentine's. Have a perfect Valentine's Day from Jocelyn. Do you want me to take that one up too? On the door? Okay, I will. And... Um, Oh, and these here, yeah, these, yep, there's your two faves, your faves. There's one for Plymouth, my, my fave, and a uh, cutie, meow. Thank you so much, Kaya. This is very cute. See how that just folded right up? That's pretty cool, isn't it? <laughs> Thank you so much. Sporeo, appreciate that. We'll take those up for everybody to still see and share for a few days here. That's um um bail bayas. Uh, oh gosh, this one's from, from Japan. Isn't it amazing? It just amazes me. A key A K I K from Tokyo uh Japan. Oh, it says thank you. Dear Jackie and all the volunteers, thank you so much for all you do. You work hard every day, but you keep smiling and caring for kitties very kindly. You are an angel of kitties. I have been watching this site, FFRC, from last July. I'm laughing with you, crying with you. 
I'm really enjoying with you. Especially snow, Snowball and Bonito Flakes was great entertainment. Oh, <laughs> did you know what we did on that, Kathy? No. We took, Judy S. and I went out when it did snow a little bit, and we made two big um, snowballs and put a towel here, put snowballs on there, and then we covered, we just sprinkled heavily all the bow needle plate. Uh, then when they were done uh, with that, then we poured um, chicken broth on it, and oh, they wow. liked it. They uh -huh. liked it. Recently, I knew you lost your caterpillar in our sweet sesame. I'm so sorry to hear. It is, it is hard to lose our dear cats. I had three cats, but they passed away four years ago. One of them was just three years three years ago. I miss them, but they are always in my heart. I hope you will recover from your deep sorrow very soon. <coughs> By the way, I love all the webcam viewers. They are very kind and thoughtful. I always tears flooded oh flooded to the kindness of them. I'm so glad I was sharing this site with such a wonderful people. Thank you, everyone. If I have some courage to chat in English, I will try to someday. Anyway, what I want to say for Jackie is thank you for everything. I wish you good luck and all the best. Many, many love from Japan to you. I'm not good at English. Sorry if you don't understand my English. A key, I think it's pronounced a key. It's, your English is beautiful. And your letter is very beautiful. Oh. This, and then she sent a postcard from Japan. And look at that. Isn't that cute? And she wrote, um, Dear all of the sweet kitties, what a pretty kitties you are. I can't stop loving you. You are so lucky, cared by wonderful mommy Jackie. And wonderful volunteers, please keep your health. I hope that you have a long and healthy, happy life. Hugs and kisses to you. Thank you, Aki. I'm going to put this up on our cork board from Japan. That's really nice. And I love your card. Thank you so much. That's really, really pretty. Wait, isn't it something to hear from people from Jackie? From where all did you from? Those are all from somebody called Sporio. This is from Linda T from North Canton, Ohio. Another Ohio person. Uh, <laughs> oh, and Nuki, if you could put that. Uh, her, oh, her chat chat name is Tabby Lynn. T A B B Y L I N. And her first name is Linda. And Nuki, if you could put, she sent a donation for the Tree of Giving. And she wants it in in uh, loving memory of David T. And I will put that last name on there for you, Linda. And, oh, this is nice, too. Her chat name oh, is Tabby question. Lynn. She says, Jackie, if you get a shimmery torty, and I think shimmer would be a good name. Love, Linda. I don't think we've ever used that name, have we? No. I, that, I will keep that. I'll keep your posty note, and we will use that name. Um, check this out. Isn't that pretty? You know, all these Avanti cards are just really, really pretty. Can I see them? Yeah. It says, thank you so much for all you do for the sweet kitties. I love all of them. I look forward to watching the antics of the kitties and the volunteers every day. Bless all of you for the countless hours put in by such caring people to keep the kitties safe and happy. Linda, and that's Tabby Lynn. Linda, thank you. And um, I'll order, this is one thing I was going to talk to you guys about too, uh, about the tree of giving tonight. So, um I'll, uh, that's on my list of things to talk about. So thank you. Now make sure that one goes back down there, okay? So we don't lose that's anything. Right Those are for my mom for her birthday. Uh, this is from CJ Cat, our good friend. Oops. <laughs> I kind of messed that up. And yeah, and CJ's from Pennsylvania. Mm -hmm. 
That's a Valentine's card. Where is it from? Here, you want to see if you can read it? It's from the from um, Sporeal. Right there, can you see the letters? Um, oh, CJ, thank you. This is a Nuki. This is a donation, and it's in in <coughs> excuse me in memory of Butch, Mandy, Tabby, Jazz. And bear, and uh, this is for our a memorial for them. CJ, thank you, thank you for that. Oh, the doggies. Oh, and then there's another one from my from my mom. Goodness gracious, I don't know where this one is from. Look at the stamps on that, though. She'll get a kick out of that. He's an eclectus parent. Eclectus parent. And this one is from David S. from from Florida. Uh oh. Here we go. Is she all right? Yeah, she's fine. And Nuki, it's it's Donald S. And there's a a donation from Donald. Thank you, Donald, if you're watching. He's from Jupiter, Florida. Thank you, Donald. I appreciate that very, very much. Um, great. You know, it's so nice to get you all support. You know, <laughs> Jenny and I. <laughs> Jenny is the one who has helped me in the past with our newsletters, and we're we're working on something a little bit different for this year. And she had just sent me an email tonight that she was um, I sent her some stuff that that would go on it. And um, oh, it in March. Yeah, yeah, uh, CJ, I, that's what I was just going to talk about. Um, we usually do put out a newsletter, a muse letter, in March. And this year, I think we're going to do something a little bit better. And CJ, let me know if this is okay with you. Um, we always pass out information when people come. Uh, I've still got probably just 200 of the last year's newsletters left. And I think this year I'm going to do something a little bit different because... You okay? Okay. <laughs> Hang on just a second. Okay. Is this what you're talking about, Lisa? I don't know how to do it. PayPal. Yeah, it says PayPal. Yeah. Those are all the same one. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, but no, 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 no. It has one credit. No, those are paid out of PayPal. No, that, those are, but yeah, that's a credit. If it says credit, not debit. Uh -huh. But there, but look for ad sets too. No, no, just that. Only do. Okay, thank you, honey. Um, so we were talking about the newsletters, and <laughs> the funny thing this year is that, um, that. There is nothing that I can add to the newsletters anymore that you guys don't already know because you guys are seeing it and living it with us. So I'm going to do something a little bit different because everything that I would put in here is going to be old news by the time you guys, anybody would get it because you experience this rescue center every single day. So what we're going to come up with is I have to have something to hand out at the door for everybody and anybody that comes in. It's good PR just to, as they go out to give them our newsletter or some information. So we're coming up with a one-sheet page. It's going to be, we're going to be able to triple fold it, and it's going to have all of the different websites. It's going to have our, our website and all the different links to our things that are in the computer. And it's going to talk about volunteers, um, our, have our wish list in it, our our uh, purpose, our um, 
just anything and everything of utmost importance of what we stand for will be on it. And then what I think we're going to do is our memorials, like what CJ did, we're going to have a, we'll do a memorial page in the website on a, on a page. So I think that that's what we're going to do. And CJ, I hope that that works out with you okay. Um, because I got thinking about this, there's nothing in this that would be of new news to anybody out there. Hi, Diane. I will. I'll get, I'll get um, Missa here. Um, I'll finish up, and then Miss is first on my list. So that's how we're going to do it. So there will be a new attachment. i got to talk to our, our web guy, Lens, and uh, see if we can set up a page for in memories of or in honors of. So uh, then that brings me to uh, something else that was kind of cool. And there was something I wanted to read in here. I should have marked it. Oh, Dodger story. Now, some of you that got this newsletter will have read, have, will know this, but Dodger, our big silver pin that's in the office that we call Dodger's pin, that is in memory of Dodger. And I was just going to read his story to you all because a lot of you may not know Dodger. Um, it says, we always have a few oldsters that spend their retirement years with us. The following is Dodger's story. When I answered the rescue center door and saw this dirty white head sticking out of a box, my first thought was, this poor cat looks almost dead. Do you remember that when he yes. came in, Kathy? Yes. Oh, he looked terrible. The man who brought this old fella to us had a neighbor lady who had died six months prior. Her family came to clean the house and tossed this dear cat outside and locked the house up. The neighbor saw the cat during the first two weeks and then saw him go under the house. Almost six months later, they saw him stick his head out from under the crawl space. After coaxing him out, they realized he was in very poor condition. This is when Dodger entered the rescue center. We see a lot of hardship cases here, but this one broke our hearts. Dodger turned out to be a geriatric cat completely covered in tight mats, had rotted teeth, was emaciated and dehydrated. Not only that, his bottom was covered in stool, blood, and literally thousands of magnet, maggots. He was shaved, bathed, hydrated, rotten teeth were pulled, and the terrible maggots were removed. The huge wounds on his backside required a daily bath for weeks. We did that. The, the first week, Dodger's days consisted of eating, bottom bathing, healing, and sleeping. He was a very tired, weak cat. He will live his life here at the rescue center, being one of our oldsters. His wounds are healed, and he loves to be cuddled. He knows how to tip his head, the signal he would like extra food, which we would always oblige him. He is loved a lot, and he knows it. When I wrote that, um, Dodger, of course, was still with us, and, but before this newsletter was printed, he passed away on Valentine's Day last year. Uh, we had him just a very short time. I'm going to show you a picture of him. It's on yellow paper, but it'll, it'll work, I believe. There's our Dodger boy. Yeah, that was a very sad day when we lost that boy. We held him and loved him and held him while he passed over. He was a great cat. He was kind of like a water, wasn't he? Yeah. He was. Her body. Her body was another. Another and wonderful old boy. Okay. So I wanted to share that story with you all, and thank you for listening to me. Um, wanted to let you also know a couple things. Um, we uh, Thursday, day after tomorrow, we're going to take um, three kitties up to our our vets, and <clears throat> um, two of them are the boys. Uh, that's going to be uh, Dickens and Bayaz. 
is going to be getting their neuter job done. And there's a new cat that you folks don't know about yet. It's a Torty Tiger. This kitty was hit a, a week ago um, in Lima area. And a friend of mine lives over there. And she does some rescues with dogs. And she's got a real soft spot for, for, for kitties also. And um, she got wind of this kitty. And she went over there. It took her a few days to be able to catch this cat. Because he was she was so, so scared. She's a Torty Tiger. Um, a Angel Kisses. Judy S. wants to name her Angel Kisses. So she found Angel Kisses. Do you have an Angel Kiss on your phone? Yes, really you dark. do. And my nose. And your nose. You've been sprinkled with an Angel Kiss. Mm -hmm. And um, so she finally found her day before yesterday. And she came to her. She did come. She was just scared, so scared and so skinny. And in just that week's time, her legs are so atrophied. It's amazing what, how quickly your muscles can become atrophied by not using them. But this little girl has at least three fractures in the pelvis, and and I'm I'm believing that also maybe the the head of the femur might also have some fracture in it. But um, I bathed her, and she purred and purred, and she's all clean and fluffy. There's no dirt on her anymore. Her tummy's full, and she loves to be held. Judy has held her for about an hour today. And so we're just going to kind of beef her up tomorrow, and she will also go then with um, Bayaz and, and uh, Dickens. And while she's there, she will get a uh, – <coughs> oh, excuse me. She'll get uh, an x-ray on her hips and her, her uh, femurs there and see, see what the extent of the damage is. So um, Angel Kisses is her name. She's a real sweetheart. Uh, we've got some work to do with her tomorrow to help her um, get as strong as what we can in the next 24 hours or so. And uh, we'll keep you posted on her. I'll bring her out and show her to you tomorrow. Um, I wanted to let, uh, I, but I did contact Eileen through uh, email, but, oh, let me go get them and I'll show them to you what I want to, what I talked to them about. Sorry, You've all seen out there are on through the website we have that um, tree of giving that is so beautiful these are the leaves that go on it and and uh, this is from Eileen this is a memory of her freezer and uh, we're gonna wait till a little warmer weather and then we'll wash our tree down from the winter dirt and uh, we'll get that on Oh, do you have to? Yes. Yes, I will. Let me show this one. The second one is for Sesame. It says, whose gentle spirit remains eternal. Isn't that wonderful? And this one is from Sharon T. And we'll get both of these up there real soon. Um, Diane, give me a second and I'll go find Missa and show her to you. She is yeah, here. She's been off. cruising now, so let me see if I can find her. I'm going to have to get a paper towel that's wet. Tell her. She's going to have to
hiding places, or sleeping places. That's true. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Of me waking her up. Here's your messy girl. Your mommy's on there. She says, Kathy, can you grab that? I've got my own something. Here's your messa. <laughs> oh, she misses you, Diane. Hello? Your mama's on there. Yes? She's doing real good, though, Diane. She's eating real good. And she's cruising around now. Yep, this is your missa. Diane is in Florida. Yeah. That's from your mama. Okay, fine. All right, I'm sorry I woke you up. Octavia, seriously. Yeah, well, come here. Okay, ready? She said purple. Mama, she said purple. Damn, have a vote. What color should we do Octavia's paw, people? Purple. Purple? Pink. Pink. Purple. Blue, purple, blue, pink, purple, hot pink, red. Purple. Pink, purple, orange, purple. Scarlet red. I do have red. That'd be pretty. Just I got you, man. Purple, green, purple. Let's put scarlet red. Scarlet red for her crimes. Oh. <laughs> for what? For her crimes. <laughs> for her crimes. That's cute. Or orange for a prison jumpsuit. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's actually a good, good idea. Oh, she's going to be. I know. Ready? You shouldn't be mad. I was just want to make a mess. Okay. Hold <laughs> oh, it. It's okay. It says. Oh, she. Do you want some help? Did she get you? All right, now stop. You're ready? I don't know. She called me. Nope, maybe not. She's not going to do it. Nope, she's mad. Oh, Octavia. It would have been so cool. Kathy's got paw prints all over this place from other cats. But I guess she's not going to. She would not have it at night. Oh, oh dear, I was even going to try to do a close up of it. Remember that cat with red poppers? Octavia. She well, knows what she wants. Another time. Yeah, we'll try it. So, I had some other um, bits of news this year, too. We're sorry, Octavia. She says, I told you guys. Told you. Um, uh, so Eileen and Sharon T, we've got your, we've got your um, leaves here, and we'll get those up as soon as what we can with the weather. And then Dunnikin and Georgia, um, Georgia, she's going to be here tomorrow. The mama's going to be here tomorrow. She may end up keeping Georgia and bringing Dunnikin back. Dunnikin is not being happy there. He's still hiding. Um, she didn't even see him today. She's going to go on a house search tomorrow, and she will find him and bring him back. And um, she's really, uh, her and Georgia are really clicking together. So uh, we may may just have her bring uh, Dunnikin back and send a different cat with her. Uh, she wants one that's really forward and playful and loving. Uh, but Dunnikin is so very worried. So I'm very anxious for Dunnikin to come back. I kind of kind of worried about him when he went out. You know, he wasn't happy at all. And um, so now I'm really worried. I can't wait to get him back here tomorrow. But we'll, we'll work something out with her. And then uh, Fifi, just for you guys to know, I'm not sure ah, if Auntie Fee is that. on, but Fifi is going to have her surgeries. Uh, well, it might, <clears throat> might be just an entropion. It might also be the third eyelid on top of that. It's going to be March 7th. So I also need to call back tomorrow and see if we can get the two kitties, Jake and, and Jaina, to have their next x-ray on that day, too. 
And then, um, Donica and Georgia, Fraser, Sesame. The new cat is Angel Kisses. And Mr. Beindorf was here today. He's the one who makes all of all of these things for us, the tree leaves and all of the, the uh, signs that we have around here are like Patience's pen. All of these things is from Mr. Beindorf. And I talked to him today. I said, we have a lot of people who have donated individually for uh, the storage room. And he said that he would be happy to make up um, these uh, signs and they will be probably something like this big and he'll print the names on there of anybody that's donated for the storage room so what I what I need to go back through and pull out all those names and find out individually I'll try to email people as I know the know them know the email addresses if you want your real name if you want your cam name or your chat name, or if you want both on. And he said that he would be happy to do both names if you'd like to. So we'll we'll work on that. So I think that that is all I have, unless you guys know something else that you wanted to talk about. Yeah, he's a, uh, Mr. Bindorf's a pretty cool guy. He he said no problem. And then what we're gonna do is we'll put those those names on the door that goes into the storage room. You know, Dumpster might be a very, very good fit, Leanie. Um, I know he likes Georgia. No, there no, was about three no. different ones I was going to show. Can, can, um, whoops, wait a minute. Can we show the pics of my babies? Was that coming from? Oh man, where do I have those at? Oops, I have to, I have to get them. I think I put them up. I have, I have uh, folders that I keep all my stuff in. I don't have any, uh, for sure adoptions right now going on. Yeah, I'm feeling better. I didn't sleep good last night, so I'm gonna try to hit the stack a little earlier. Teach volunteer. Have volunteers teach me how to play. <laughs> He's such a crazy little boy. No, you know, now Dugster, he really is fine with other cats. He When he goes in my house and I have 10 cats in there, they get along 100% fine. They race up and down the stairways. They run around the dining room table, up and over the couches and the chairs. So Dugster is okay with other cats. Um, uh, she's going to let me know tomorrow morning when she comes. If she brings both of them. Then she'll wait for a kitty. If she brings just um, Dunnikin, then she'll take another kitty back with her. Yeah, it's hard to adjust. Huh. Um, I was kind of thinking of um, maybe Tilo would be a, he loves um, Georgia or Gramanique or Dugster possibly. She's a really cool cat, I too. Her. I know. She really is. Remember, she made prints. Yes, she did. Yeah, Dugster. Oh, my gosh. All you have to do is hold Dugster, and he's he's a baby. Yeah, he's that Dugster. He sneaks in the house. Well, he doesn't sneak. He bolts in. Say. <laughs> and he's wonderful with all my cats. And the bird. He loves my bird. Oh, he mews and mews around the center. Oh, poor Bales. A good slugging oh. night call. I probably wouldn't wake up for 20 hours. <laughs> Nuki. Yay, teacup. Way to go. Way to go. Yeah, I might take like a fourth of a Benadryl. That'll sock me out for a few hours. Yeah, yeah, I think, yeah, Dexter, you know, he's doing better, but changes are hard for him. That is true. We'll see how, how things go. How do you get the printed newsletter? Well, um, cats... For lover, if you send me um, an email with your address, your physical address, I'll send you one. 
<laughs> That's what Paul keeps telling me is to take a hot toddy. <laughs> um, I do have, you know, that person that called the day after Dunnikin was adopted that they were also interested in Dunnikin and that's a family I there they would be great good for him it's a small house small family but the other one is too but big house and um but if I do do Dunnikin that way I'm going to take him over myself and stay for a while make sure that he's okay <laughs> they like your green shirt Kathy oh um, you know, Hummer, um, Diffie and Turing, they really don't need to be adopted together. And uh, and that's because they play with everybody in here. I don't even hardly ever see them really sleeping together anymore. They're everybody's friends. They're, they get along beautiful with everyone. Um, Quayside, yes. Pever, no, Peverly's Remember is on hold. To go with uh, Tweeny for to Colorado, yep. Quayside hot buttered rum. Mm. Aw, that's wonderful news there, teacup. I've tried baked balm too. Yeah, I, our problem here is you know we just wash everything so much. I wash our hands, wash it right off. But that is good stuff. Yeah, our newsletter. Oh, I have to check on that. Oh, good. Oh, I'm so glad Niven's doing better. I thought that would put him, kick him over on the better side. Good. I'm glad to hear that. Quay said, I'm trying to see if I can find you here on here. I'm kind of behind a little. Uh, Dunnikin came without looking at his record probably last late summer. Place I can check if Amazon attached a gift note in my box earlier. Um, you had a box. Didn't we have a box from you last night? Quayside, did I miss that today? Quayside, let me know if I missed that. Doggone. Someone want to put um, the, it's, a, it's, here's the email. It's FFRC Moss at gmail.com. Is it? Are you saying, Quayside, I got a box today? Quayside, are, um, are you saying I got a box today from you? Oh, oh, that was Quayside. Oh, let me check one thing. Oh, yeah, you know how excited it is. You know, you're the only one. I don't know how you do it. Yeah, so Nuki, can you put that on there? Oh, thank you. Thanks, Nuki. Somehow or another, something that Elaine and Willis does, their name goes on the outside. And I'm not used to seeing that because it's <coughs> Quayside's the only one that does something to get that on the outside. But it'll say free, Feline Rescue. From Elaine and Willis. Yeah, it is on here, Quay. Thank you. Yeah, they like that. They like that cheddar stuff. Good old Vaseline. Yeah. You put your name in the ship to address. Huh. Oh, 
Okay, well, we got it, and I and I thank you. I thank you, Quayside. Corn huskers. Oh my goodness, I forgot about that. We used to do that. Okay, well, I'll start looking for more of the names on the outside. Yeah, there was not a gift note in at Quayside, but it does have you your name on the outside of the box. <coughs> I should have I should have looked at that. Cricket, the clippers that we use here. Somebody just asked me last week what we use. Um, well, they're they're like a hundred and twenty, but my goodness, they last me forever and ever. <laughs> Thanks, Critter Cat. Their um, wall, Arco wall, uh, and they're four cats and dogs, and there's there's a couple different settings on them, but it's an Arco wall, uh, rechargeable. They, that's the only kind I ever buy here. They last forever. eBay charity auction. Have not heard of that before. Yeah, wall, W-A-L-H-L, Arco, too, is on there. It, Lainey, if you just look at their little claws, there's that, that pink vein. That's their little blood vein there. Just, you know, don't cut into that. Or or if you're nervous about it, just clip off the the hanger, what I call the hanger part of the claw off. You may not get it as short as what you possibly could, but then you won't cut the cut the nail bed there. Um, and if people ask me this all the time, well, if I make them bleed, are they going to bleed to death? No, they won't. They will clot, but it may take a little while. But just, yeah, if you push out their paw, because, you know, they have retractable claws and get their claws out, you can see here where that blood vessel starts just cut before that. Yeah, you have to be extra careful on the black nails. Okay, guys, uh, yep, yep. Or, or you know what, if you don't have the septic, um, uh, oh, gosh, I'm sorry, my brain is... Is not working pencils or the or the powder you know we get the clotting powder here if I clip something um, you can use flour or cornstarch or you know anything that you can push up onto that nail or if you want to bring your cat here we'll clip them for you and anything that's powdery you can push up in there it'll it'll stop it okay well I think I'm done I'm gonna clean up and uh, Kathy's thing over there says, um, it says, come eat at Octavia's Diner. And I don't know, Kathy. Let me see if we can move the can and see if it's good over there. i got to get that extension thing on here. Cool. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Can you read that? It's got yellow stars all over it. I was going to put her paw print in red, but she's... <laughs> oh, thanks. I think I'm going to change my hair color. Are you? To what? Hmm. I'm not <laughs> sure. Here's the one sign I really like. It says, we have the best volunteers in the world, thanks to each of them. Yep, and look at this little sweetheart. That's Raza. Isn't she cute? I just love her. <laughs> hey, is there Colorado mommy on? Whoops, Daisy. There's Tweeny. <laughs> hey, Tweeny. Isn't she beautiful? She is just so shiny. And there's you guys with him line that you like. Yeah, what was that name of the Tordy Shimmer? That would be pretty. And <laughs> there's our patty boy with the tongue sticking out. You see his tongue sticking out there? <laughs> Get your tongue in. And over there, there's a whole bunch of them. There's uh, Twinks, Twinkle at the top. 
and Diffy. Hi, Diffy. And little Preakness there at the bottom. McCallan just went by, and that's uh. Oh, no. I used to always go in the bathroom. Again. Yes. Who did Fergus? Today? Fergus did. Yeah, He'll right sit in. on your lap while you're in there. Yeah. <laughs> And there's a pretty. I already got you, kiddo. And I don't think this will reach in there to get anybody. There's the big red. Kathy, can you see the big red bed on the cam? Oh, yeah. Yep, that's. And there, look at that. There's Jane. Can you see Gina and Jake? And look at their tails flashing. Oh, they're just tormenting each other. <laughs> they go at it all the time. Is it worse? It's kind of a empty tail. Oh, that was cute. <laughs> it's like a trampoline. <laughs> oh, they have too much fun. They do indeed. Okay, folks. Well, I'm going to put up Valentine cards and and uh, get some things put away here. Thanks, everybody.